Welcome to Effect Custom Uncensored. Today, we're going to uh, put holes in a bed for a fifth wheel. I'm going to show you how to do that. Uh, I'm going to start off by getting in the truck. Uh, I have a bed that already has the holes in it. Uh, so I got the measurements off of that. And I'll explain them as we go. Uh, I have two holes on each side for this and one in the center for the with a fifth wheel ball. I went and I marked the center. This is the center one right here. Uh, I had 46 and a half to the back of the hole. I'm gonna come back. Mark 46 and a half right here. And uh, I was lucky enough to have the bed to get the measurements off of i'll tell you how to do how i would have to do that if i did not all right so we got 46 and a half that's to the back of the hole uh this hole is four inches what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put my tape right there on that and what i call burning inch i've got five inches right there i'm gonna come down and mark four right here like that that right there is going to be the front and the back, that hole. And I did, I found something that was actually four inches around. I'm going to use it to draw my circle. Put it right there and line it up with the front and the back. That, see what, what I probably need to do is want me a center right here. Yep, and go. Do the same thing. I've got four inches, so I'm going to put that on a three. Go to my one mark right here. And my five mark right here. Okay, that should give me where my holes should be. I can line it up. Line it up. I'll just draw it this. Gotta make sure my lines right down right there. One thing on this side, make sure you mark it right up under it. Okay. There we go on that. <clears throat> have that hole marked. Uh, what I'm saying is, I don't, if you don't have a bed that's already got the holes in it. Uh, what you would have to do is probably, uh, or what I would do is put the bed on the truck and then mark the holes up under it. All right, so on this right here, this right, this goes right here. This is where you hook your chains up. So there's two holes there. I have the front measurement on that, 43 and a, and a eight. I also mark these. We got the center here, so that's going to be on this line right here. Forty-three and one eight. There, it's gonna be in the center of that. Right there is a inch and three quarter. We'll go inch and three quarter. It's gonna be five eight. Right, yeah. Right. Quarter. No. Seven eighths. I go seven eighths in. I'm going to use my inch so I know exactly. All right, so seven eighths is going to be right there. There's the center. Okay. 
Maybe it's messed up. We got right there's 43 to the front of the hole. That's still the front of the hole. We got a three quarter inch hole. That's what I was thinking about a minute ago. All right, so we got a three quarter inch hole. That's the front. Start off at an inch and the three quarter. There, three eighths, you know. Right there. Well, you would drill a hole on that one. Same thing on this side. Yeah, forty-three and eight, right there. We got a three-quarter inch hole. Go three eighths in. That's the center. We go to the center here. Seven eighths. Was, I'm just gonna eyeball it, which is up. Right right there and right there is where you would drill for that one okay so they're three and one eight inch in between the holes so i can go three and one eight inch from that hole to this hole and that'll give me my next line my next hole mark so three and one eight i'm burning the inch well, that right there moves really can get a good accurate measurement right there so three and one inch one eighth would be four and one eight. Right there's the mark. Center right there. The hole there. Same thing right here. Up to four. One eight. Okay. Okay. There we go. So those are the two holes right there. Right, and I have a, a bit on my drill that I'll drill those with. Step down bit. Uh, I did cheat a little bit. I got and marked where I have to go down. <clears throat> it has the measurements on the inside right here. Uh, but I put a piece of tape to just know how far I got to go. Uh, we'll start drilling and I'll measure it when it gets close just to make sure. I'm gonna have to change change plans real quick. I had to get a pilot hole. I wasn't sure if I was gonna have to do that or not, but I will. Don't want it to move. It did a little bit, so we're gonna. If you notice when I went through that, it went down. <clears throat> this one over here didn't. I mean, something up under it. it has a shield or something up on it. We'll have to, I'll have to remove before we put it on the truck. All right, let's see if this does a little better like this. I do see a piece of metal right there, so we'll measure that and see what that looks like. Because yeah, that'll work. So we'll do that. <clears throat> we'll do that three more times.
pieces of metal is coming off they're hot uh this does get warm when you do that try to go at a <clears throat> smaller uh, slower speed and help with the heat but those done those are the easy ones uh, <clears throat> we'll take this off and uh what i'll do now is uh oh, where that came from it's not good it may come out of the drill uh anyway i'm gonna put a pilot hole in here with, uh, not sure what size bit <clears throat> probably start off with this one and get a bigger one uh, I got a little air pneumatic saw, jigsaw. Uh, that I use to cut the hole out like with. I don't have a hole saw. Wish I did. It'd be a lot easier. Uh, Saw blade to go in. Yeah. Well, didn't take much pressure. It falls through pretty good. <coughs> A little tight. Work. All right, we're gonna uh, cut it out with this. <coughs> Try to follow the line as best I can. Uh, it's a pneumatic uh, jigsaw. It's got a little little metal blade on it. Not really working real good. Get it, so it'll do a little better. Sorry about that. I should have had this already ready. Thing has a little island. On the side, loosen up, take the juice all out. Blade, I mean. Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Well, she's using electric. We won't have to worry about the air compressor coming back, huh? Okay. So what it does, it's got a new blade on it. Maybe it'll do better than what we have. <coughs> Same principle, this one's just electric. Definitely working a lot better. I would cut it out. Uh, I was saying earlier, if I didn't have the truck bed to go by, I would have put the bed on and I would have marked the center of these holes from the bottom and I would drill them with an eighth of an inch drill bit and I would have took the bed off and did the same thing I did here and then put the bed back on. Uh, I guess that's it for today. Uh, we're going to uh, put this bed on to be the, one of the next videos, I think. Subscribe, like, share. Definitely want your comments. Have a good day.